Lazy Bear Games. More Tiny Build. Oh, man. Yep. Whoa. So Tiny Build seems to be something of a theme for us this year. Yeah. In Horror Month. So we, the first game we played for Horror Month, is, and and it is an ongoing series, it will be, we'll be playing it for the whole Horror Month, was Final Station. And now we're playing Tiny Build's other horror game. Yeah. Graveyard Keeper! Hey, you were probably expecting a little bit of Stardew Valley, but hey, Graveyard Keeper is basically Star- Stardew Valley in a graveyard! Yeah, just like we chose uh, Final Station because it's uh, resemblance to Action Kickers. Yep. Action Kickers yeah. Door Squad. <laughs> Action Kickers Door Squad! Now, I mean, yeah, if you if you were looking for similar content, you still get it. Yeah. You, uh, you get your, your Stardew-esque fix. Uh, just, it's Graveyard Keeper today. Because so, it's horror month. All right, so yep. let's do New this. Game. New game. Let's make this happen. Yep. So this is like it's a little bit like Stardew Valley. A little bit like Stardew Valley. Now I have played the game a little bit, as you may have seen when I was going into the play screen, just to kind of get a feel for it. There's an ordinary day in our heroes hurrying home, where someone very important is waiting for him. Even in everyday routine, there's a place for loving and feeling loved. Especially when you know that someone misses you. No! Oh! What happened? Where is everything? Calm down. You merely turned a page in your life. You've, not your. A whole new chapter awaits you ahead. But I need to go home. Can I go home? There is always a way to get home. Let me see. Your new home is a graveyard. What? Does that mean I'm dead? It means you're a graveyard keeper now. But I need to go home to my love. (laughs) Then you need to be a good graveyard keeper. You should dig up Jerry. He'll help you sort everything out. Who? What a strange vision. What is this nightmare? Okay, let's find Jerry. (laughs) You started kind of anime, and then you kind of became Bobcat Goldthwait about, like, about 80% 80 of the way through. Yeah, I don't know what's happening with him. Yep. It's death, it's okay. death can do weird things to you. Death can do very weird things to you. Whoa, look at this graveyard. It's crazy. I've never seen anything like it. Oh, I'm going to dig up. Okay. Holy sword, I'm a skull. Are you Jerry? Hmm. Why would you think I'm Jerry? I was expecting Seinfeld. I'm... I'm... <laughs> A man with the red eye told me that I need to dig up Jerry. <laughs> red eye! I remember! Oh, sorry, that's right, I'm Jerry! How did you find me? <laughs> the man told me that you'd answer all my questions. <laughs> good, good, but let me ask you. Who are you? Where the sun are we? <laughs> I must be dreaming. None of this can be real. Hmm. You know, you're the new gravekeeper. <laughs> what else do I remember? Let me think. This guy's awesome. I remember that sound. Let's go check it out. Everything is so strange. None of this makes any sense. I definitely remember a bell and something like a donkey. Ah, something's wrong with that animal, huh? Could be dangerous. <laughs> oh God! All right. Okay. Let's go talk to the Danky. <laughs> I got a fresh corpse from the town. Wow! A talking donkey. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you can understand me. <laughs> Let's talk. I'm giving him the same voice as the guy. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> I am cheap labor. This cart is not mine, so I have to work for the capitalist bastard who owns it. 
<laughs> I love it. And I only earn five carrots a day. This situation is deeply humiliating. You know where I'm coming from, right, comrade? Oh man, this guy's this guy's Russian. The bastard pretends that he doesn't understand anything I'm saying, man. Anyway, I need to get back to the town, guy. You get rid of this one and I'll bring you a new one, okay, fella? What a strange land this is. Wow. And corpse dropped off. Donkey wow. walks away. Hey, what are you staring at? Grab that juicy corpse while it's still fresh. What for? I feel like we should take it to the morgue. I don't remember why exactly. But I'm pretty sure it'll be fun. And it might be profitable. Oh, I'm gonna puke, man. Let's do it! Alright. Grab a thing and go. Sorry, I like this place. Feels like home. Put the body on the autopsy table. Stop screwing around. Then what's next? Oh, yeah. Slice some flesh from that corpse. That should be good for starters. What? No way! This isn't right. I'm not doing this anymore. Sure, sure, it's not right. How can I forget? Maybe because I'm a talking skull with amnesia! <laughs> Is it right that you don't know where you are? Is it right that I'm a skull? Nothing is right here. So shut the sun up and do what I tell you. Now! You promise you'll tell me how to get home? You just need to trade the meat in the village tavern for a beer. Talking skulls never lie. <laughs> and then bring the beer to me. Okay. All right. Ooh, a preparation place, a pallet, and you have to extract and I some learned flesh. To extract flesh. Oh my god. Well. Time to autopsy the body. Let's do it. Boom, sh-da, 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 You've unlocked an ectology, and you can create a burger, a sandwich, or baked meat. That's disgusting, man. You'll get used to it. So what should I do with the corpse? I don't know, let's bury it. Take the corpse, I'll wait for you in the graveyard. Bam. All right. All right. Oh man, I don't know. I don't know anything about this place. It's crazy, man. Huh? What's gonna <laughs> happen? Nothing good can come of this. No. Let's parry it. All right. Gotta use the blueprint desk to make a grave. All right. So toss that down there. And let's build yourself a grave site. Oh. A suitable spot. Let's I'm make it, toss it down here. That's a great idea. I like that or like spot. Like that maybe. Well, not quite right. enough room for three next to one another. So. No, that's kind of bunk, eh? It's a little bit bunk. It's a Slightly bit bunk. bunk. That's yeah. fine. Put it there. That's fine. Okay. All right, and I'm just gonna move this with me while I go. We'll chuck that down there. And oh, you let's gotta dig. Bum, stump, bum, bum, bum. Whoops. Whoops. There we go. I, inter I that to bitch. Wait for inter the corpse, and now I fill it back in. Yeah, you did it, man. Nicely done! This burial certificate! I remember! Money! Alcohol! Alcohol! Hmm, I'm sure I used to like it. A lot. Oh, Sard, here comes the bishop. He's your boss. Oh, fuck. Oh, I know! Ask him about this burial certificate! He should know! Something! I better leave now. I'll be at the morgue waiting for my beer. Peace. Dear me, I'm so tired. Why? Why do I have to come here every week? 
Damn. John. <laughs> John. <laughs> ah, keeper. There you are. <laughs> I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but your graveyard, it's a mess. There's no way I'm promoting you to cleric. I mean cleric, until you fix it. Damn. Wow. All right. Yep. So, uh, yeah, our first major task. So is your graveyard quality is at least five. I don't know, five. I'll be pleased, pleased to promote you. Get out of here. You look like a spiritual leader, and I'm a good judge of character. Ha! Ha! I'm good at everything. That's why I was chosen to represent his will. Ha! Ha! Your predecessor used to keep his stuff in the trunk Somewhere here, you should check it. Check it. I'll <laughs> come by again next week. In fact, I come here every shield circle, purple circle. <laughs> Maybe I'm not dreaming. Did I eat something? Oh, he's he's waiting. What should I say? Uh, uh gee, why is it you come here? It's part of my duty, the unpleasant part. It's kind of an old tradition, damn, wow. I don't know much about all the traditions and rituals. But I'm here to represent his might and glory. Ha ha. I got one tiny question. What is this burial certificate thing? As soon as the body's been laid to rest, you can trade its burial certificate for money. At the village tavern. <laughs> New task. Okay. All right. I'm not the keeper. I need to go home. This is a talking skull. He forced me to butcher a corpse. Ha ha! Fine joke. I'm a humorist myself. Here's one. Wow. Who is BB? Who? I am. Ha ha ha. Blessed and beautiful. <laughs> Just repair all the graves. Shouldn't take me even an hour. But you know what? It's your job. So, if you run out of repair kits while fixing the graveyard, you can always craft new ones. Okay. Damn, this is coming hard and fast in Tutorial yep. City. So, one of the things actually that I, I really enjoyed about um this game in in comparison to stardew valley is there's actually like these uh research trees that you have to like put your research into and you have to do different tasks in order to get these colored spheres which represent basically experience points ah so you gotta so unlock like, stuff yeah so like if i wanted to be able to for example create a nicer type of grave site um i would need like to get woodworking and then uh be able to create these wooden <clears throat> beams and i can make like uh statues for people and all sorts of stuff and this is and there's a bunch of uh oh, wow. different yeah so these are just like, yeah, farming in nature, smithing, building is the one I was just looking at, book writing, theology. Like, yeah, so that's just a humble marker. I can learn to make simple gravestones, then so stone gravestones. I can cremate. This this game actually goes really in depth and it's pretty awesome. Yeah, it seems pretty so, cool. All right, yeah. well, let's 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 do some stuff. 
Yeah, oh, let's chest. do some stuff. Wow. All right. So I'm just gonna grab. I'm just gonna grab everything. Yeah, grab yes. grab all of the things, all the tools and all that stuff. Okay, and so now what we need to do is to clean this place up a bit. And so I'm I'm gonna go ahead and clean the graves that are like um, in the need, the sort of need the most. Yeah. So what is so the fix this gravestone? What does the minus one mean and the minus two and the minus three? So that is basically beauty of the graveyard. Oh, so you can take that so up in, to Yeah, my see my quality, if you look in the upper right corner, is currently negative twenty seven. Oh it so, stacks. <laughs> yes. Yes. Alright. Well that's And so we wanna fix up the really bad ones. Yeah. Obs, First, right? In order to, yeah, see, now it's only a minus one where it was like a minus three, and this one's also minus three. The cross is in pretty bad shape, so is the fence. Let's fix the fence. So we were at like minus 30, now we're down to like minus 23. So we're making progress here. Uh, this grave has no fence. We could build one, but we don't know how yet. So that's one thing. We can fix the, the gravestone, though. Like let's fix what cross. we can fix, you know? Exactly, right? So let's just go through, fix as much as we possibly can. Of course, every time that we fix something, we do use up a, uh, a toolkit of sorts. So, right, and but we, can, we yeah. can make more of those theoretically, right? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Um, so actually, this is going to be higher value because it's made of stone oh, except we can't fix it because we need stone tools in order to do that so we can use our wood tools on this one all right yeah. well so there's everybody... a lot that goes into this but uh yeah so this is gonna be pretty involved if you're interested in seeing more of this uh please do let us know uh we're very interested in hearing your feedback and i am happy to play more uh graveyard keeper for you but this is going to be uh filling our our uh farming slot <laughs> yeah it's, it'll be filling the stardew valley uh, slot at least until uh for horror month for so. october and then yeah, yeah after that we'll be back back to it yep Tr trying to romance you, the town thank you for joining us yep and uh, you know what we may just we may just find a little bit of romance here too. Oh God, wouldn't that be awesome? You know, right? I'm uh, on my way to town. Yeah, at in in the, at night. Yep. All right, join us next time. We're gonna go to town. Yep. Bye. Bye. <laughs>